Hello friends, welcome to my channel Rex Rahul. In today's video, we will learn how can we achieve auto completion for our Java command line applications. So let's get started. So for this video, we have created a simple application uh, which will take some parameter from the user and will just display it. So uh, using the Pico CLI framework, we have created this and we will use the same Pico CLI framework uh, to generate uh, to generate the script which we can use to create the autocomplete feature for our Java application. So here you can see we have defined some of the options name, caps, age and password. So we are not doing anything but we are just taking these and printing it to the console. So this is our simple Java application and uh, we will be using the user info command. So, ooh, so now when, uh, so what happens when uh, we type when command and uh, hit tabs. So what happens, uh, you see all the available options for that application or command. So we want to create this feature. We want to create autocomplete this feature for our Java application user info also. So we want to use it like user info hyphen hyphen and we press tab all the options should be displayed there available options for this application. So let me brief you about this uh, application. So we have used the Pico CLI. We have used the assembly plugin here to create the fat jar. So that jar we will be using to basically access the application using the command line and uh, we are using Pico CLI version 4.6.2. So let us first create the jar of our project that we will be using. So we have created the jar using even clean install and after that go to the target folder and check jar is there or not. So we have created this jar and just try to use this jar for now. So we will be typing java hyphen jar and without giving any option or argument it will print the help as usual. So we will be we will try to use some of the options let's give name so you can see the application is working so firstly we want to uh, we don't want to type this java hyphen jar and this whole jar every time so we will create an alias for it and the alias we will keep the alias name as the same as we have defined in the pico cli command name tag so it is the user info so we have created it so then we can use user info hyphen hyphen help so it is working you can see for version it is also working so let's check for the name name equal to rexaho so yes so our application is working now now if you see the tab is still not working to get the tab autocomplete feature to work for our app application what we will have to do we will have to create a script auto completion script using the pico cli so we will write java hyphen cp provide our jar and for this jar we will have to use autocomplete class that will be generating the autocomplete shell for our application. So for alias here, user info, and we will provide the main class in which we have given the options. So Here you can see user info completion is created. So this is the shell which we 
use which we will use to auto complete so if you type user info hyphen hyphen tab so you can see it is still not working so we will need to use we will have to source this shell so source this shell and after that try to use user info again so press tabs so you can see the options are displayed here so this was the feature we we wanted to achieve so it is achieved now so what we what we have done is uh, will be available for this particular terminal session only so what we want to do is to permanently add to uh, the bash rc so that uh, we can have this command and its auto completion feature to be enabled by default so we will add some of the uh, lines in the bash rc we will conf configure our java application so you can see for the new console it will not work so what we will be doing we will go to our home directories bash rc so just open your home bash rc and add the commands like uh, we have created an alias previously so we will need to create alias here also so user info is the alias for our java hyphen jar pico cli so the whole the path to the jar and also we have to source the user completion shell also so now go to the terminal open a new terminal actually so when you type hyphen h it is working and when you type when you give some options it is also working and when you press tabs it is also giving you the options available thanks for watching my video if you like my video please subscribe to my channel rex rahul Thank you.